Hi guys, Matt Edwards here with Vaught RV, and today we got an exceptional trade-in from our Airstream store. It's a 2020 Liberty Outdoors Little Guy Max. So uh, I'm gonna do a kind of a quick walk around over here on this unit and show it to you. It's super clean, super nice. You'll notice the outside is all your fiberglass outside with the Asdell and block foam insulation. I've been doing a little bit of studying on this unit. It has seven windows on it, okay? They're European style, insulated, dual pane acrylic windows with integrated shades and screens on the inside, okay? Then when we go on the inside, I'll show you all that, okay? Up here, he's got a cover for your propane bottle and your battery, okay? And this is kind of neat because he's got his little levelers right here that he can use. And this is the small battery, the small uh, propane bottle that you can pick up at 7-Eleven, okay? Closes up here and latches down, okay? You look like you've got room up here if you want to mount a generator or for carrying extra stuff, okay? It does have a power tongue jack that levels it up and down. Really nice, convenient. Diamond plate. And you'll notice all the windows are really, really nice. All the graphics are nice for a 20 model, okay? Got your hot water heater over here, your crank down stabilizers, your sewer systems right down here for your gray and your black water, okay? It has a nine gallon black water tank. Gray water is 25 to 30 and fresh water is 20, okay? This little trailer weighs 3,000 pounds, okay? Max weight is 39. So that means you can pull this with a Toyota Tacoma, uh, small truck, small SUV, uh, Jeep Gladiators, and some of the other Jeep models that'll pull up to 7,000 pounds will pull this, okay? Got the aluminum wheels. Outside shower. Look at the store right here underneath the bed. And look how nice and clean it is. There's your crank over there also for your, stab for your stabilizer jacks and your, your uh, awning, okay? They also put a tube right here for your sewer hose, which is really nice and convenient, okay? Closes up. These are all magnet. They close tight. Outside shower is easy to get to. Okay. The back of it has a receiver hitch back here that weighs that you can carry about 150 pounds. It's great for uh, bikes, toys, a kayak, anything under 150 you can mount there. Okay. Now, if you look up the top over here, it's kind of hard to see, but it does have solar panels, a the TV antennas up there, as well as your AC unit. Overall length of the little guy is about 21 foot. Okay width is about seven so it's going to be easy to park in like a backyard or garage um, exterior height is just right under 10 feet okay so that'll fit in some garages your your crown moat your your awning up here is crank out like i mentioned and it clips into these sides over here on the trailer or you can put it about there on the ground power plug outside tv mount plug and speakers okay and this is an aluminum step, okay, which fits a lot nicer and it's a whole lot easier to pull out, okay? All right, you got your grab handle right here, your LED light, which is really nice and just nice and clean looking out here, okay? All right, let's go inside. All right, welcome to the inside. When you walk in, when you first walk into the trailer, on your right hand side is your dinette for, for your eating. This will also drop down and make a full bed right here too for you, okay? You'll notice all the pretty woodwork. It has a uh, TV that pops up. It's kind of cool. You've got storage up here, nice woodwork. Okay, TV goes back down. Now here's what I really like. Right now I've got the day shade down, okay? So if I want to open it up, I can do it like this. These windows do pop out, okay? And if I don't want any sun coming in, I want to get ready for bed. See how those all fit in the tracks and how nice and neat it is? All in good shape. They took very, very good care of this trailer, okay? And you have these blinds on both sides, okay? And both these, win all these windows open up too for breeze, okay? You've got storage up here, all screwed, no, screw no staples. 
All right, so move out of the galley over here into the shower. Okay, has a glass door. Now it is a uh, a wet bath, but look at the size in here. I am about five eight, five nine, so I mean it's pretty decent up here. I can stand over here, take a shower. It does have a porcelain commode in here, nice shiny and cleaning. It also has your uh, your levels, tank levels, right over here for your black tank. Toilet paper is protected. Uh, nice shower handles. Turn around. I mean, this is pretty good, pretty nice. And I also have a fan in here too. Okay. All right. Let's step out over here. Okay. And over here we've got our galley. Okay. We've got a stainless steel sink right over here. Again, the same window treatment systems. I can go up and down, and of course this window will open. But look at all the nice little cabinets. Cubby holes are here, you know, to put stuff in. Nice wood, okay? Got your microwave over here. Got a three burner stove, okay? There's your lighter right there for it. Looks like they used it a couple times. Okay, towel rack. Now we look at these drawers down here. Look how nice tongue and groove that wood is, okay? Liberty makes a very nice coach, very nice trailer. Look at the size of these drawers over here. Freaking huge, okay? This trailer will actually sleep three to four people quite comfortably. We've got our dual refrigerator over here, Dometic, okay, with a small freezer up there. We've got storage up here again, and then we've got a big drawer right here. I mean, for a small trailer, this thing has got a lot of storage. Okay, over here you've got your clothes rack. It's all screwed and glued in there. A little tray that pops out. More storage there. That'd be a nice place to keep shoes, boots, stuff like that. You've got your heater, vent right down here, your gas detector, and your uh, fuse box right there. The floor on this is, I think, is beautiful, especially with the light wood and the lights that come through here. It's just really, really nice. Now, in the bedroom area back here, this bed, I'm probably about 5'8", so, you know, I've got plenty of room in here. I've got a cup holder up here. I've got a plug. I've got a little bit of storage over here. I've got the windows. And across from me, I've got a USB port, some more storage, speakers, and a nice TV. And again, you know, these right here that can open and close. And all this in a trailer with an empty weight of 3,100 pounds. So, I mean, this would be a great trailer to go have fun in, a little backpack in, or, you know, off the roads, off the grid a little bit. Um, if y'all have any questions, please put them in the comments below down there. My name, my, ad, my email address, and my phone number is there. Uh, we're going to post this up pretty quick. It probably won't last very long, but, you know, y'all give me a call. And if we can uh, set a time up for y'all to come look at it, I'd be happy to show it to you. Y'all have a blessed day. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions, be sure to drop a comment below. Or if you have any suggestions on content you'd like to see, we'd love to hear about that. Go ahead and give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again from Bot RV.